Last week, Phil and I were getting ready to share something really exciting, and that was that I was pregnant, and we'd been on such a massive journey to get to that point, emotionally mainly, and we had our first scan last week, our 12-week scan, and were devastated to discover that the baby's heart had stopped beating and we lost our baby two days later uh, and yeah there are no words really we're just devastated It's been one of the hardest things ever, but it was really, this is really important to me to share what's going on and I will share how, how I'm moving through this and how I'm, I'm dealing with this. I taught my, um, my love hack group last night, which was coming, coming back into, into work. And it was it was definitely the right thing to do, sharing sharing with them what's going on and how I'm moving through it, which is so much of what I'm what I'm teaching them to move through their stuff. And it was a powerful group, and it was powerful for me. And it's and it's good to know that um, I can be back in the working space, and that that's a good thing. Um, the day before, I wouldn't have been able to. It was, it was, it was a hard day, a really hard day. And yeah, it's super important for me to share this with you because I think, well, because I'm just absolutely unable to go forward without, without sharing, and um, it's impossible for me to hide exactly as I am. This has changed me in such a massive way, and I can't hide that. This is this is how I am today. This is how I am in this moment, and more more authenticity. And so, I don't I don't need you to be any different. If you see me, if you interact with me, I don't need you to tiptoe around me or to be sad yourself or anything. Um, I just need you to be you and it's okay to talk about. It's hard but it's okay and I think this is something that's really important and needs to be talked about. We shouldn't hide these tragedies, these losses. It's incredibly painful and and we you know we, we are coming back to joy. We will we will be back. <laughs> But the grief, the grief is ever present, and it's it's a big thing. It's a big thing, and um, I will get to sharing more about our journey and and the massive triumphs that have been involved in this, because um, there there are many, and there are. Uh, this is really cracked. This is cracked us both open. But I'll just talk about me. It's really cracked cracked me open in so many ways um, but it hasn't broken me and yeah it almost feels too soon to be talking about the gifts and the light that is coming into those cracks but there are there are and um, I just feel really reticent to label this as a bad thing it's a devastating painful thing that I wouldn't wish on anybody but so many people have experienced this and um it's really, really common, and it's, but that doesn't make it any less devastating. And so, if you too have experienced this, my heart goes out to you. Um, and I encourage it, even if it's just one person, to talk about it, to talk about everything you're feeling. And um, yeah, I will, I will talk more about it, and I'm open to, I'm open to answering your questions about it if that's helpful. Uh, for me, I just needed to do this because 
it was it's it's impossible for me to show up um, as a guide, as a healer, as a coach, and and ignore this and to try and hide this. It's 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 not hideable. <sighs> okay, that's that's enough for now.